you guys are better than this. I have to figure out. But I, I'm, I, I'm fighting more openings. I think. I think I'm doing less poorly against him than the other week. But I, he still has the upper hands against me. It's like it's like one of those players that I I just don't understand how to beat him yet. And it it has been the same in melee when I used to play against him. He was the player my bracket killer every time. It happens like four times in big tournaments where he would he would just kick me out. Yeah, I mean, even in melee, that's a uh, that's a hard pill to swallow. Well, I guess, but I still have better overall results, so I don't know. Is I have to figure him out because that's probably one of the reasons why I'm losing against top players. But it's well, not it's not too bad. People have uh, uh, people often have their uh, like their, uh, their hardest player to play against. I want to say. Yeah. I know there's a specific term for that, but I, I just cannot quite catch it now. But uh, it, it, it just have it just has my number. Yeah. Even right. quite like uh, how uh, Ungry Box could not beat Mango for his life before, but would beat every si every single fox except Mango's. Then for some time he, he he bodied him after that, and then it's back it's back to even. So just over time you're gonna adapt. I I want to say you're gonna adapt. You're gonna well, adapt I want to. Time. It's not that I want. I, but I I really want to play again against him because I feel that I figured out some stuff, but I don't know for sure. The oh. smash is gonna take it. I swear if Sharu wins against Fairlines, I'm gonna lose it. Well, if uh, Sharu is playing well today, it's, it might be hard. Yeah. Now he has a stock lead, but he's on the verge of, of losing his own stock himself. He has enough fuel, of course. And the bouncing fish, that is gonna be enough. Only 6% extra credit, even game. Oh yeah, okay, he makes it back. Usually when you do the uh, spinning thing with Robbie, you, you die. <laughs> oh no, that would have been... Uh... Yeah, but he was high enough. Okay, so currently, Shogu having a harder time on that second stock. Caroline's just shredding the robot to pieces. Only 29% on, on pair lines. Doesn't set up oh. the gyro, goes for the back air instead to cover the jump. Very good option. Down two? Yep. Okay, gets the up air at the end. Gets the last hit. Now fair lines has to be careful because I think a little more percent, it's going to be a uh, percent. Oh, okay. nice mix-up. Oh, yes. He reads yet. it. Not going to kill. Oh, Ooh. he's so deep. Went for the void combo. The air ball <gasps> needles into bouncing I don't. I, I don't agree with his offstage play right now. He doesn't need them to get the kill. Okay. So Fairlines gets game one. Yes. And Shadru is going to count pick Town and City as usual. Not that there's any reason for him not to go on Town and City, of course. But I'm trying really hard to find a stage that gives a hard time to Sheik. I don't think there's any. Uh, well, Sheik is a really versatile character, so uh, even though there's a way to adapt your game style so that your stage is not too too much of a counter pick, so. Oh, weirdly misses the, the up air follow. Oh my god. It's so hard for Rob to land against a Sheik that puts pressure. But once you get an E hit, it's like it's a huge deal. Yeah. Now Rob in trouble off stage. 
Caroline's is gonna go off stage almost every single time. Down throw, the B boop percent. Yes, he waits for the air dodge and yes, gets it. Very good. So Shalgu just flipping the situation around. Doing very good. Yeah, you have to be careful with Sheik because just uh, 80 percent means a B boop percent. Yep. And it's scary. It's a kill every time. I respect Sherry not going to uh, let go his uh, shield. Oh. Down throw. Okay, Ooh, tries to get the air up, dodge. Like... Ah, that's cute. Of course, you wouldn't expect to be uh, down there by Sheik. <laughs> Sheik is at like 50% and he almost dies from the... Uh, from the up air. Oh, tries to get a little cute setup. Oh, he has to be careful. Jumps out, very good. Because now the rage, I think, is going to seal the deal with a 1B boot. Yep, and if he can read the now... Caroline's reaction, yes. Yes. Okay. Shalu's in the zone. He's very, he's very expressive when he plays today. Yeah, he's always been like that. He's one of those players that does uh, facial things whenever he has to do something technical. <laughs> now, will Caroline's be able to come back? It's going to be very hard to be... Uh, if Shalu lands a grab, that's going to be uh, very risky for Caroline's, of course. It sends Rob off stage. Oh my god, Shalgu cannot come back on stage. Oh! oh! The Giffy Cat combo not completing. The down <laughs> smash. If that would have been the end, I, I would have been angry. Oh, the back here! Oh god! Oh, and now it's 1 1. And we're gonna go to FD. I'm calling it now. Yes. But it's not too bad of a map for, uh, for Rob. Rob. No, exactly. Exactly, as always. Without bans, Fairlines is going to go to town and um, to oh. final destination every single time. What? What the hell? They didn't go for the uh, bouncy fish? Kind of spread. Jab, jab. Oh, and confirms it to a gyro. Nice. Down throw. Oh! oh smashing fair. skill from Fairlines. Chugger leaning in his chair. Oh, the back here. No! Oh! Oh, went a little bit too deep. Caroline just jumped over him. Ooh, that's dangerous for Sheik. Oh, nice uh, stuff from Shari, not committing to anything, so... <laughs> Furline scouted that really hard and he Ooh, gets the bouncing, gets the bouncing fish. fish. And now the needle game. So Shalgu having a hard time against that Sheik now. Yes, he has trouble to get anything going. Mm. Mm. Using the there. extended vanish. Now Furlan's at big boop percent, I think. Okay, no grab. Oh, Chesty, go for the smash again. Down throw. Oh, and goes directly for the up air. Yep, that's yep. gonna be it. So 60% is okay unless Fairlines does Fairline stings. Which is punish you for 30%. Down throw. Guaranteed up there. Yes. Oh, nice roll. Oh, up tilt. Doesn't that was good. Doesn't convert into anything. That's getting dangerous for Charu. Oh, uh, Bunsen Fish was guaranteed, but he went for the F tilt instead. Ah. Uh. So it's gonna be dangerous. Oh, did the needles and the gyro clash? Ooh. I respect the down air. Yeah, he went for it all. 
Get flipped by a bouncing fish. You don't want to get caught by that. Okay, jabs out of down tilt. Just to block the grab. I've been noticing, uh, so Rob is just basically a meta metallic Diddy Kong. You down tilt to grab. Yeah, you throw yeah, stuff yeah. To he works the same way. Uh, yeah, he does have lesser options to land, but he has a better 50 50. Yes. It basically works the same way. At some point, Sherry thought about going Diddy. But now FD is out for Furline, so Lilat, let's see. I, I would go li no Battlefield instead. I would have went Lilat, I think. But I'm no Shaolu, so I'm not top three. Or top five at this point. Yes, it's top four, actually. Yeah. So he knows way more thing he knows way more things than I do, so Well it makes sense because since Sheik has trouble killing and uh, he doesn't Yeah well it it's kinda evens out because Sheik has trouble killings and Dreamland might be better for the platforms and the uh, low ceiling but I guess that it enhances the fact that Sheik will have even more trouble to kill. Yeah. I find it so funny that Battlefield is... Oh, oh, it pops out. Battlefield is tiny in comparison to his, to his blast zones. When the camera pans out, I mean, Battlefield seems so tiny. Yes, uh, you're right. But the stage is really small, actually. Wow, oh, wow. Well, the vanish, not quite killing, but... <laughs> the weird angle on the, on the laser on the stage. Oh, oh and he reads the landing. Smash, yeah. This is when Furlines is scary because if he gets a momentum, uh, is one of the player I am most scared. Well, there's still Fly Skill, which I hate the most. But <laughs> Fly, uh, Furlines is really scary when he's focused. The back air, not quite enough. Oh god. Using those reactors. Oh, oh, he just followed the my roll. God. Very smart. Yeah. That was deep. That's an even game, for sure. Down throw. Up air. That's uh, an, an even more even game. Oh, the out of shield reaction from Fairlands is really big. Okay, I like how I reduce use the. Uh, the fact that Fairlands went deep to get back on stage and get, get, get a little bit more control in this match. Up okay. here. Very good string. F2 gets the fair. I think we'll see a bouncing fish. Nope. No, very good uh, shot to dip super low, but that was dangerous regrabbing the, re the ledge there. Oh, the roll got red Ooh. and the air dash right after. And Fairlines ending Shangu's run. Well, I have to play against Fairlines, it seems. So, BRB, guys.